Well, hello, my fellow Wavies, Zabak here, and welcome to another video of RGB Makeup MZ tutorials. For this tutorial, it's going to be about day and night cycle. How to change it into a day cycle and into a, a night cycle. Oh, and that's based on a comet event, which is coding actually. Actually, and it's like time concerning dawn, day, dusk. Night and midnight. Night. You're supposed to put him, put him on all parallel. What? And then it's based on time. So hold on. Just make sure I'm actually doing this right. Right, and then it should be all pretty good. Yeah, there you go. Go now. So start with the time counter as your first one. Yeah. Control variable. You can time counter a single one. Do that. We'll create a bench of 600. You go zero to four. 10 minutes plus. There you go. Oh, and then we end it with a 60 seconds. Two minutes to hour one. And a 24 to hour zero. Oh, I know how it works. Then you have a way of dawn, day, dusk, night, and midnight. The six, seven, and off in, to, the, to the inside of the switch. Fish, and then you just tilt the screen like that. Same thing with day, we take the screen to normal, so everything is zero. 18 to 7. This one is 19 by 24, 5. But this is what so the screen it's gonna look like and then midnight is the same thing and what this red looks like for turning the screen once you got them all look at 67 7 to 18 and then once again 19 25 and then 0 to 6 6 make sure they're all on parallel Setting. Now there's supposed to be like a digital clock counter too, but that's more like based on thousands of pushes you have to take off. So yeah, don't worry about that. And, but what you want to do is just put a, a event on parallel and put a switch on time. And then put, you can put another switch on display time. Turn it on no, and then put this fire thing and to change the time to plus one hour. And you just go ahead and play. And there you go. 
Oh, that's the way how it works based on time. You keep going with it. It it would actually change the screen. So it's changed soon. There you go. Oh. I now if we change the it's dusk, yeah it's dusk. I think this got to be thirteen. It's got to be twenty, actually. There you go. Oh, that should actually make it a lot better. So let me enter this area. So yeah, so into midnight. No, I will keep going until we hit day. There they go. Let's stay down. See that now the screens change color into the time shift of morning, afternoon, night, and and midnight, and then we get to get into the next day. And there you go. That's the way how it cycles through. Maybe we'll one more. more. Yep, there we go. That's the way how it cycles through. And D so. Nice. So there you have it. That's how you actually use day and night cycle through the way of coding and a common event. Alright, that my link I'm going to actually the video here. Here, and there you go. It's a pretty short one in D, so now you know how it works. Works based on variables, switches, and a parallel target. Alright. I'm gonna leave the video here, so thank you so much for watching. So, if you got a comment, like, and subscribe, if you join two women, do follow me on all my social media accounts, and I'll see you next time. Bye.